Welcome everyone to the Real Whovians cast. I am your host, Matrix Lord 212, and I'm with Scott. What's up, Scott? Hello, all. All right, so the other day we, we had got the news that Alex Kingston was going to be appearing uh, for Big Finish with four different masters. Nice. Um, which is interesting. Uh, some people are not crazy about it because they're like, you know, why can't you do it for real canon rather yeah. than Big Finish? Some people think, you know, that it's a gimmick just to get attention. I think I'm happy that she's going up against Missy. Yeah. I'm not crazy about the Derek Jacoby thing because I like to believe that he was just a master briefly, you know. Yeah, just for that. He wasn't way. that way always, you know. Yeah. Um, Eric Roberts, that's pretty cool. Yeah. I still, and, to this day, for that 96 movie, I still think they should have went the way of a, a piece of cord. See, but the that. problem with Eric Roberts' master is he didn't, he, after he gets saved from that, he's probably going to regenerate. Like, they're not going to have him be on adventures. I mean, if you get swallowed yeah. by the eye of harmony or whatever, you're not going to be. So, like, the, the fact that he's, you know, I understand that he was a fan of, oh, that'd be cool to have Eric Roberts. Okay, but... I don't think it's canon. That's what I'm just trying no, to say. No, they're not. It's Jeffrey one of these, Beavers. They're, they're, they're connected to Doctor Who, the fact that it's Doctor Who, but as far as the main... Think about like an alternate stuff. It's, it's like the novels. Yeah. Um, and then Jeffrey Beavers from, you know, Keeper Trock in 1981. That's, that's yeah. you know. I can see them doing him. That's cool. But Missy's my main thing I'm concerned with. I don't want to say... Yeah, I just so, I mean, the yeah. Eric Roberts one. I just can't. He's just like one of the. I hate saying he's like one. He was just like a happenstance for the, for the for year two thousand. That might actually be good because he might really play off against Alex Kingston really uh, well. You know, I think. But um, I wish we had news other than we already said. There's a rumor that the Centaurans are back. We know the Daleks are probably going to be back. Um, and the, the Centaurans are going to be rumored, rumor that they're going to be not a clone batch. They're going to be pretty tall. They're going to be very intelligent. They're going to be naturally born Centaurans. No more cloning um, and threat. But they're not the main threat of the story we heard. There's another bigger threat, but we'll see. I, I, I do want to, I can't wait to see Doctor Who ready. It's been, you know, it sucks that's off the air after for a yeah. while, you know. So, and then we had the news that Twice Upon a Time was an extra, what, half hour? They cut. Yep. Which I'm like, why? Why can't we have that in a DVD Blu-ray? Like, just put it together. Yeah. Do it the Moffat edition or some shit, whatever. I mean. Or if you want to really, grant them, do, re, redo it to the uh, big screen as a, for Christmas or Thanksgiving or New Year's and Basically, better do it for New Year's. That way, you gotta it'd be kind of interesting to. We still gotta do reviews, man. We haven't done them in a while, yeah. so I gotta make time to do that. Um, we just finish off Tom Baker's run. It would be nice if we could. Um, the toys is not really anything, guys. I'm sorry. Um, nothing I went, to. I, I went to that little comic book shop, which is near, which is uh, in the same thing as Hooters and. Uh, TJ Maxx, mm -hmm. and they pretty much had the same one, same things that we saw on the. Uh, yeah, uh, I mean, I don't think anybody wants me to whip out all the toys that we had before. Like, the, yeah, we had it. I showed it already. And this camera's not I really apologize. Um, what else can we talk about, Doctor Who? Was anything? I mean, nothing, right? Uh, Moffat and Rusty Davis, they were talking up their books. Um, you know, it, it looks like they just, in some cases, made it from scratch. It's almost like it's a whole new adventure, even though it's not. Yeah. In Moffat's case, it probably is that way. Um, and I really want to buy them, but they're not available here, unless I can buy them overseas, but then it's going to be a fortune ship. I'll have to find out. I mean, I could buy the ebook. I, don't, I want the actual thing in my hands, though, you know? Yeah. So, what else? I think that's it. That's it for the Ruben's cast, I guess. I mean, all right, Scott, are you, are you looking? What, are, what do you want to happen, man? I mean, yes. What do you think what needs to happen? What I think needs to happen is one: if we're going to have the Centaurans, yes, let's let's do it logically. And I, I shouldn't say logically because Second Doctor's got uh, a, a factoid about that. 
Uh, but no, if it's gonna if we're gonna have the Centaurans, let's have the Centaurans do a great battle and see how this different twist on naturally oppo- natural opposed to cloning works. What I want is uh, to see them start every every season start doing the blah. I'm getting brain farted here. Okay, take all companions aliens and villains opposed to the ones that they already have they're using right and i don't care if it's an adventure or if it's a cameo but take two out of those three stick them in each do it for a season for each following season that's what i would love them to do that way when it leads up to another celebration the new fans will go, oh, that's who they're referring to, or that's what they're referring to. Because they'll I mean, even do that for the fi- leading up to the 50th. This was cool for pre comic book day. Oh, yeah. Nice. Um, I showed you before and everything. Yeah. Show. Um, now, All Works looks pretty good, too. I mean, how cool is that? Oh, oh, I love that. Right? That's cool. I love that. I guess David Tennant's doc just got a new companion. And then, I don't know. What's going on? Oh, so they even got the seventh cool. doctor in there, too. Oh, good. Cool. They got a whole bunch of doctors in here. It's not just those. It's placed be- between uh, probably around the time uh, of Astrid and that. Or before I think they're just going in all different directions. I don't know. But this is pretty cool. Very nice. Um, oh, it's so funny. They got all this other merchandise that we've never seen here. They got Doctor Who bowls. They have little mugs. Look at this. These figures I saw, I'm not crazy about that Japanese style. Whatever. Yeah, me neither. Doctor Who bowls, there's Doctor Who mugs. Is yeah. You know, all kinds of stuff there. I mean. Somebody did something of like a little flash uh, of several years ago, some fl- a flash cartoon in that same anime. And all they did is they took uh, mm. uh, sound checks from the third doctor and that. And we got this, too. I mean, she's, you know. Yay. We're getting ready for her. Um, okay. You know. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, guys. I mean, it's not, you know, oh, my God, the doctor no, came out of the TARDIS. How exciting. Like, you know, I, I, I don't know, you know, what you want me to, you know. How excited you want me to get about that? I've seen that how many times already. But, okay. We'll see. Positive, because Doctor Who is coming yes, back. We've been, too ne- we've been too negative. We're, tra- we're going to be positive. We're gonna no, try it's not to that positive. we're negative. It's that the situation is just... Yeah. We're not... It's not... It's hard to... I mean, come on. If we're not... I'm not going to fake it. Okay? If I'm not happy, I'm not happy. If, if we're happy, we're happy. It's just that... You got to give us a reason to be positive. Yes. You know, and, and when you take yeah. away episode counts and uh, not give us any info, we're not really happy. So, whatever. All right, we're out. Take care. Bye for now. Bye.